Dream Team, you asked for another video. You asked for the little Mellow Ball series. So now we here. Now I went through the little attributes, you know what I'm saying? I fixed a little bit of things here and there. I didn't want him to be too crazy, but I still want him to perform, you feel me? So none of these attributes will be official. It's pretty much just for this one video. And then as we progress in the series, we're gonna be tweaking things here and there, man. We gotta make sure we knock it down these greens, you know what I'm saying? Like, and you already know the vibes, man. That three-point jump shot is a 90. <laughs> but don't sleep, man. I make sure I get the right animations. Make sure we get the right dunk packages because LaMelo Ball can dunk. Don't sleep on me. And I did add, I think, three or four uh, past high school teammates on Spire. I mean, they don't really look like them, but you get what I'm saying, right? See, back in 2K17, I did the Ball Brothers series. It was kind of lit. I did like, what, five or six episodes? With this series, I'm aiming for at least 10. You know, you gotta keep this series fresh. Then we'll move on to the next one. I got ideas on ideas, man. We gotta keep progressing, creating fresh content, things like that. But anyways, I created this guy right here, Tino Williams. He's a fictional character with a fictional squad. That boy go crazy. But let's see what the vibes is like in this high school championship game, man. Let's get it. Yes, sir. Y'all know the freaking vibes, man. If the vibes is lit, smash that like button. Yeah, Juice Man. Say it with me. Juice Man, Juice Man, Juice Man. Whoa. Back up on the NBA 2K20. My career. Bitching your boy. LaMelo. LaMelo Ball. Trying to go crazy in the high school championship. Trying to facilitate the game. Already poking the ball loose, man. I mean, we out here playing some defense. I mean, slightly. You feel me? But we start off the game. Setting the tone. Coming down. Shooting greens. Bang! Y'all know the vibes? Let's get right. See, one thing I like about Lobello Ball, like, when he gets aspire, he adjusted his game. He's a lot smarter on the court. He was making better adjustments. I mean, he still was himself shooting that thing from limitless range, but he kind of controlled the game by facilitating the game, dropping off them dimes, going crazy, getting his teammates more involved than ever, bro. See, I'm telling you, in my opinion, LaMelo Ball will be the best out of the three brothers, bro. No cap. As you got see Tino Williams get into the rack right there. That boy getting greens, bro. I made him somewhat of a Chris Paul type of player, but I ain't make him too OP, you feel me? Like, I got to make sure it's still competitive on both sides of the ball. But look at this, bro. Big defense, big snacks, snagging these Rihannas. As LaMelo come down the court, he see the lane, he jumping in diamonds again. That boy Isaiah Jackson going crazy. <laughs> and like pretty much in his first quarter, man, it was like Isaiah was just in his bag. And right there, Tino getting to the racket again. <laughs> Bad defense on my behalf, I'm not gonna lie. He went around the screen, he had an open lane, it was all hands. But right there, look at me, going to the basket, easy pass right there, Isaiah with the lays. Let's go. My boy in this bag right now. But yeah, man, pretty much the series gonna go from starting at Spire to getting to the NBA, you feel me? But right there, try to go over the lane, dropped it off to Isaiah again, picking up another assist as we well on our way to getting a triple-double already. But I gotta do something, dog. Like, it's just about that time. I gotta show appreciation to my boy, Harry 1000 Watts, man. He always under every single video with the positive vibes. It means a lot for all the support from all you guys as well. But shout out to my boy Harry on this one. Let's get it. And please do not be in the comments asking for shout outs. Your time will come. Just show genuine support, comment, you know, unique type things. And your time will come. I'm just going to say that right there. Just to clear the air, you know what I'm saying? But let's focus back on the game, man. The score is 26 to 26 and I don't like it. My team gave up a lead. Now it's time for me to take over this game, man. I am Lil Mellow Ball. I go crazy. Hold on. Crossover. Snatch. Crossover. Just when you thought you seen it all. Hop stepping in that paint. 360 layups and it was nothing but a green. Yeah, dig. <laughs> I would not cap to y'all. That, that, I promise that was a green release, bro. It was so unexpected. I did not expect him to do that, but it was a green release. But as these dudes trying to get buckets and keeping the game close, I gotta let these guys know, bro. LaMelo learned from that boy Juice. He go crazy for limitless range with the ice in his veins. Yes, sir. <laughs> we start turning up as a squad, man. We was getting buckets left and right. We was out here getting these stops. We're on a crazy little run, bro. Even the takeover had activated, dog. Even the takeover had activated, but I ain't gonna cap to y'all. I wasn't able to abuse it. But look at your boy lurking. Kenny Steele's going all the freaking way. We was going crazy. 
We went on a crazy run. Perfect play executed right here, but referee called it illegal, but it still looked green. I promise these refs is capping, dog. That was perfect timing. That was not illegal on me. On me, that was not illegal, but we got 14 points. Fariana still, six assists. Let's get back to what we know. It's Tino, get into the rack right there, bro. Great off-ball execution. I ain't gonna even cap. Not even gonna cap. But let me get back to my unselfish ways. Getting these dimes from my boy Watts Wide Open from the top of the key, knocking down the three. Yes, sir. Get it. I hope you guys having a happy holidays whenever you're watching this video. But don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. Leave a comment down below. Subscribe if you're new to the crew. Dream team with the best team. Yiddy. Let's get to the second half, man. We still got to go crazy. We still got to go crazy. So as we jump into the second half, we got a nice little nine-point lead. You know, we feel a little comfortable, you know what I'm saying? Defense is doing pretty well. We stopped with everybody but Tino. As the shot clock took it down, he was forced to take a bad shot. And you know me. I'm dropping these dimes, perfect pass, oh my goodness. Such a high IQ pass right there, man. Like, your bounce passes are very OP in 2K. Food for thought. But as we try to build up on this lead again, man, playing off the transition, we slowing things down. Tino playing great defense, I needed a screen, bro. Don't wanna force a three, don't wanna force any bad shots, but I'm pulling up a midi and it's green. I was sitting back thinking like, should I make Tino a permanent rival? Like, as LaMelo progresses in his career, Tino will be right there competing with him. Look at this response, getting his own green. I don't know, man. It's not like a good idea. Let me know down in the comments if you guys want to see Tino progress with LaMelo as a complete rival. That would be lit. No cap. But yeah, like even ideas of seeing Leangelo ball on a different NBL team, that'd be lit, man. Let me know what you guys want to see down in the comments. I'm kind of like letting you guys get somewhat control of the way the series progresses. So, like, let me know what you guys want to see, bro. This is all for entertainment, but look at the 2v1 fast break. Oh, my God. Preston. Why are you ducking the ball so hard, my guy? Shaking the backboard cameras. Amping up the crowd. Hold on. Let me get in my bag real quick. It's all eyes on me. I'm feeling like Tupac. Court vision found my open teammate, but sadly, my diamond couldn't help him. But we're going to go crazy. Off that transition, they're trying to push the rock down court. Cutting everything off. Hog get the ball right back, goes up, he gets blocked. Now it's time to show these dudes how to run a real fast break. We coming down, we throwing lobs, that boy going crazy. Hold up. Y'all not about to laugh at my flaming fireball edit, bro. Chill, relax, relax. Let's get back to the video, though. Hey. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, that little flaming ball was looking mad goofy, but it like a, a bad edited Netflix movie, bro. One of the bullet moves you get at the gas station or something, but yeah. Jump into the fourth quarter, man, with a 12-point lead, looking very comfortable. And I get a double team. Like, what are you doing? Like, why are y'all double teaming me at this point? Like, he came down, missed that. You dumb trash. <laughs> but getting the ball off the transition, going up with a nice finish, up and under left-hand layup, bruh. Your boy's built different out here. <laughs> He's built different out here. Hold on. Tino with the in and out, pulling up. Getting a brick off of that one, y'all saying? So I'm gonna transition again. 1v4. I'm coming down. I'm going all the way. I switched lanes on them goofies. Yes, sir. Feed my boy Watts right there as he's struggling to get these buckets, man. We got a nine-point lead with just under a minute and ticking right now. Like, I'm feeling very comfortable. Allowing these guys to shoot, they ain't built like that. This guy's pulling from the sideline. He made the shot. He can have those things, bro. I got to put the game away, man. I'm slightly fatigued. I'm out here calling plays once again throughout the game I did. A lot of plays didn't work out, but moving off ball. Hit him with the stop and go. Wrapping around the screen. Your boy getting a bucket. Get it. And, like, at this point, like, I knew the game was over. That was like the nail in the casket, man. That was a wrap right there, but, you know, these dudes ain't giving up. They... You know, you should never be taught to give up. Always try to fight no matter what the circumstances is. Basketball, 2K, in life, whatever it is. But look at your boy throwing lots of my boy Isaiah. Still getting these highlights. Let's get it. And I wasn't like trying to show no sportsmanship or anything like that. But these goofy still trying to score, dog. So what you expect me to do? Dribble the shot clock out? That ain't it, man. That ain't it at all. But we did end up winning by double digits. A 10-point victory, you know what I'm saying? Actually, 13. Somebody must have hit a three or whatever. But 
Once again, man, I hope you guys did enjoy this series, man. Leave the comments. Make sure you watch the full video because I did ask some, you know, some questions that could affect the series. You feel me? So, yeah, it is what it is, man. Going to show you guys the box score, show you how everybody performed. Your boy did have a triple-double. Shot two for seven from three. It is what it is, man. It is what it is. I tried, like I said, like you seen. They was double-teaming your boy half the time when I had the ball. So it is what it is. Tino did drop, what, 17 points. He was going crazy. But I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure you like the video. Subscribe. Leave a comment. Now you're out. Juice Man Dream Team. Yiddick.